ready? Did you get batteries? You sure you got enough? Buy enough videotape? Larry, the lens cap! You know, this is probably the most important video ever made. Which means the government already knows about it. Which means they're probably going to try and stop us. Which means we have to shoot this video within the next two hours. Okay, why again? The picture of the aliens next door that I dropped off at the photo depot to get developed. That will be ready in two hours. Right. Okay, rolling. Space. An inky blackness of emptiness. Or is it full of icky, nasty aliens whose sole purpose is to enslave humanity? We'll answer these questions and more on The Earl Files. Hi, I'm Earl, and I'll be your host. Um... Okay, fine, that's Larry. Last night, I saw bright lights coming from next door. So I grabbed my camera and took some pictures. Well, one picture. My camera's memory card ran out of space. Anyway, by the end of this video, I'll reveal that incredible photo proving that aliens really exist. Okay, I'm sure whatever is outside is very important, but this is called paying attention time. But I... if you would just... I... <sighs> and now, my first alien evidence... Dirt circles, proof that aliens have landed. And these circles are right over there. Okay, hold on, maybe it was over there. <laughs> yeah, this is the place, all right. See, the impressions in the dirt start right at the bottom of the slide. Circle around and end right at the ladder. <laughs> Larry, this is no time for playing around. Government agents could be anywhere. Come on, let's keep moving. Possible witnesses to the event of which I took a photo, which we will see later that will prove aliens exist, are brother and sister Robin and Daisy. Now, Daisy, do you know anything about the bright lights I saw in your backyard last night? Not me. So, uh, you're making a video about aliens on Earth? You said there'd be snacks. Give Robin your sour candies. No, oh, just do it. And, and yes, my groundbreaking video is about aliens. So, Robin, Daisy, do you believe in aliens and have you ever seen any? Aliens? Sure haven't seen any around here. Nope, no aliens crash landing in my backyard. No siree. I have never met three aliens from the planet Klang. Why, I've never even heard of the planet Klang before. Nope. There is no such thing as aliens. Okay, there's humans and giraffes, and Robin stopped talking about planet Klang, and cats and donkeys Danger! And danger! Daryl's ship detected! Danger! Danger! Uh, danger! Danger! In the neighborhood, alien invaders can't be good. Robin, that is the worst rapping I've ever heard. Are you sure you weren't mind zapped by the aliens? <laughs> uh, get a shot of that, Larry. This poor workmanship proves that the government is taking money away from playgrounds to build giant space stations on the sun. <gasps> Larry. Okay. <clears throat> if dirt circles and really, really bad rapping haven't convinced you that aliens exist, let me show you something else that shows that aliens exist. Using the internet, I've joined other alien believers throughout the city. We've set up a bunch of webcams, so let's see if anyone managed to capture that alien encounter from last night. Uh, no, it's not an alien. <laughs> Your wizard is so toast once my cleric cast his banished goof spell. Ha! <laughs> They're still on level five. Huh? I knew it! Some secret agency broke into my bedroom and arranged the camera so it could spy on us. Um, sure. Or maybe someone just pointed the camera that way because it would make that cool effect. Or a government agency is spying on us. Sure, I'll bet that's it. This is the weekly after-school meeting of TOTS, which stands for They're Out There Silly, where the enlightened work together to fight the evil alien menace, and sometimes we trade trading cards. I got this cool Unicorrigan card. 
These are our members, Barry and Barry. Now, we've met Robin and Daisy. This is Samuel, Mr. Marplezip, Miss <laughs> Wonka Lily, and Mr. Conka Hoo Hoo. Good evening. Okay, before Mr. Conka Hoo Hoo shows us his invention, we need to discuss something. As you know, I'm shooting a video about last night's light anomaly, and I need to know if anyone saw anything. Anyone? No siree, I can say without a doubt that I have not now, nor have I ever seen any lights of any kind anywhere. In fact, I can't see a thing. I wasn't there! <laughs> Stop asking so many questions! I'm not even here. <sighs> Mr. Conka Hoo Hoo, since our last meeting, you've been working on a device that detects aliens. Why, yes. I've created a device to help us detect aliens by... What? They said they wanted to find aliens, so I... Right! Yeah, this doesn't work. And it sure won't detect any alien within a three-block radius. Too bad. Well, why don't you give us a demonstration anyway? Uh-oh. <gasps> Nice alien detector. It's pointing at humans, not aliens. Yes, normal humans. That's what we are. Boy, <laughs> that thing sure is broken. Exactly. Those three are totally not aliens. And that guy is so not my dog wearing a disguise. Yeah, it is, Robin. <laughs> See? <laughs> All right, let's just get out of here. There's a few things I want to record before we get the photo. One unicorrigan cart. Let the trading begin. Okay, after I saw the lights coming from the Harrison's backyard last night, I decided to go have a closer look and found this. It seems to be some kind of alien looking... No, oh, it's just some kind of tube. Garbage. Ah, it's a secret agency coming to take us, and my film, and the truth, away! Oh, but I'm one step ahead of them. I've packed a week's worth of PB&J sandwiches and a change of underwear for both of us. Ugh. When did you pack those sandwiches? Ah, a couple months ago. Oh, man, it's just some kid wearing hockey gear at the door. Look, my parents are busy, kid, and I'm busy, so we don't want any chocolates, especially from someone raising money for some hockey team like you obviously are. Okay. May I borrow a wrench? My vehicle has sustained some damage and I need a wrench. Hey, what are you, what are you doing with that? No, oh, I'm just making a video about aliens and how they're planning to take over the Earth, you know. Like when, say, an evil overlord builds a noise emitter, which would render Earth defenseless, but then it shorts out, causing the ship to crash, and now he has to fix his ship, fly home and get a new noise emitter, then come back later to take over Earth? I think an alien would come up with a smarter plan than that. Smart enough for you, weirdo. Who was it, Earl, honey? Nah, it's just some hockey player selling chocolates. He's gone now. Okay, hon. Are you and Larry having fun playing with your video camera? We're not playing, Mom. We're trying to prove that aliens exist even though secret government agencies are trying to cover it up. Okay, kiddo, have fun. We have some uh, work to do. Uh, talk to you later. What do they know? They're just accountants. Larry, let's hurry up. The picture should be ready by now. Come on, let's get a move on. Now, before we pick up the picture that will blow the lid off the alien invasion cover-up, I thought I'd show you where I saw the alien lights. It was right over there. What are you guys doing here? Okay, this is your last chance to talk before I unveil my photograph, revealing the truth about aliens to the world. Did you or did you not see any weird alien lights waving around in the air right here in your backyard last night? I don't think so. Dad lit the barbecue for us last night. And we roasted marshmallows. Which were awesome. <laughs> uh, awesome, awesome. The barbecue was. No one burns marshmallows like I does. Okay, the, the, the picture's ready to be picked up. Let's go. And seriously, wrap it. Oh, for wrapping. It really is. Danger! Danger! Larry! Come on, let's get a move on. Now! <sighs> Finally, in this envelope, the proof we've been waiting for. Ah! Here it is. This, this, this is amazing. The lights. And now some final... Larry! Space! An inky blackness of emptiness? Or is it full of icky, nasty aliens whose sole purpose is to find Earth and enslave humanity? 
Have I answered these questions? Only the cosmos knows. And you, and probably the government who are most likely advancing on this room as we speak, curse them. I'm Earl. And I'm Larry. I'll just turn it off. So, how does this video look? Oh, I think it'll be even better than you think it is. Um, government conspiracy? I knew it! Government spies took the tape, then rewrapped it, and put it back into your pocket! Yeah, that's what happened. Sure, rewrapped it. Well, well, that's a setback, sure, but, but it doesn't matter. As long as I have my camera and that picture. All right, uh, let's do this again, uh, but this time, make sure no one steals the tape. You got it! Funny how they could get the tape out of the camera and back into the wrapper without you seeing it. Yeah, <laughs> funny.